Hello mates, H. Nickel here. Welcome back to Shovel Knight, Shovel of Hope. In the last episode, we took on the Explodatorium and my Wi-Fi blew up. Just kidding, not my Wi-Fi, my entire freaking power blew up. My bad. This episode, Rees. North from Pride Mall, west at the fork. Oh, brother. Father, I must have passed it already. Well met, Traveler. Oi, I remember you can help me. I think I got lost. I was trying to... Wait a second. You're the knight with a shovel. Indeed I am the... The knight with a shovel who has been menacing the village. I, I assure you I've done no such... You gonna use that shovel to bury innocent people? Your reign of terror ends here. Uh, Reese is a little confused, but his heart is in the right place. Uh, so as you can see, Reese just doing his best to be a pro kickboxer with two boomerangs. We appreciate it. He certainly likes doing his leaping around. And now he's got Yu-Gi-Oh cards. Good for him. But unfortunately, now he's dead. Now he landed on his feet, he's good. To you west, villain! Strike me down! I'm no villain, we're fighting a common enemy! We are? Oh, why didn't you say so? I feel like a fool now. I think nothing of it, friend. Knights are strongest when they work together. Yeah, knight's code, first vow. Always have a person in need. Knock him down, shovel knight. Pretty cool. Glad Riz is doing well. So, uh, the armor outpost. Wallace? Who the heck? Our scouts saw you approach. We know of your quest. This is the armor outpost. The brave are holed up here, deep in enemy territory. It's dangerous. Get equipped. Alrighty, and that we will do. What's up, fisherman? Totally your name. We languish like lovers here while treasure knight sails under the waves and this dread iron whale. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> go, go, sniffles. His treachery scares all the fish in the sea. Do us a favor and thrash him for me. Yar. Okay. Hello. Oh, that King Knight, he's so regal, such a refined fashion sense. But honestly, I'd rather be your queen. Oh, dang, alright, bruh. The heck? You know, there's like, a, there's like a big old like market for people who just want to hang out with a fish man. I mean, like, Shovel Knight's cool, but like, bruh. Hey, this be the Ariel Anvil. Need an armor upgrade? If you need something forged, I'm your fella. <laughs> Give it to me. My god, it's perfect. So, the Dynamo Mail. Perform two consecutive shovel drops to unleash a powerful charge slash. Yeah, that's right. No holding Y, no nothing. We just got a freaking... Spunk two times. That's it. That's all we need. It's perfect. Uh, we're also gonna get the charge put anyway, though. Because, you know, you know, we can be greedy. Uh, I also kind of want to get the trench blade. Like, good lord. Please. Hey, look at that. Uh, sorry, Apple, I got none for you for a little while. I do say, sir. Why, I haven't seen just a decadent airship. Since I sold mine, ha <laughs> You sold it? You sold the Glidewing? You stole the Blackbird? Sorry. With my vast riches, I could buy this whole store. But I forgot my wallet. Oh, upstanding knight, could you part a paltry 1,000 gold, no? Oh, 
well, thanks. I can't believe that worked. Oh. I buy only the best. And for my latest purchase, unfortunately, I'm only 1,000 gold short. Excelsior! Now that I have my purchase, I shall take my leave. Oh, such a charming beret. If only I had the means to afford it. All I need is a mere 1,000 gold. Oh, Ray! This is just what I needed. Thank you, hero. Oh, my precious hats! That's a lovely helmet! So lovely, so lovely! I must inquire, sir, about your curious collection. Travel the land far and wide, I do. Searching, learning, teaching, collecting all shapes, all sizes. Hats! Each one I wear grants me new power. And your hat looks powerful indeed. Intriguing, but I am rather attached to my helmet. Yes, yes, about that. Alright, Mr. Hat, let's freaking do it. Back at it once more. He's here for blood. Let's smack him in the face with what we've gained today. He's got his little fancy teacups he's gonna throw at us. Alright. What if I throw a bunch of freaking slimes? Oh, that ain't gonna work? Okay. Well, he's switching back to his... Just kidding. Enough! I don't know what came over me. My hunger for hats took control. Your beautiful hat. It's a helmet. Alright, oh, I knew that. Uh, wear it in good health, for now. Right, well, off I go then. He seemed cool. I want to talk to him again, but where would I ever find such a... Oh, bother you found me. I'm so embarrassed. I promise I'll never pester you no longer. It's the gold for all the trouble. I want gold. I want a lot of gold, even. You! Oh, I can't be serious. How'd you find me again? You're following me everywhere. Okay, okay, I'll come back. Just take my one of my gold and leave me to my hats. I think he's gone now. Uh, yeah. No, I don't want it actually. Rather, I would like to go back to the village and get some more health. But it seems I am a little bit. Ugh, I can't believe this. Trouble, friend? Have you lost your way? But the best gear, the slickest armor, the strongest rope. Uh, pardon? Are you in need of help? Uh, the stuck-up order of no quarter clowns have no idea what they're missing. Hey, you look like a knight. Uh, shovel knight at your service, but I'm I'm not in league with. So I heard that if you beat a knight, you get to take their title, right? Uh, p please don't do something you'll regret. I, I don't want to. The Great Baz Knight. Uh, I like the sound of that. They'll have no choice but to accept me now. Come on, let's do this. Oh, Baz. Alright, well, we're gonna have to just, uh, we're just gonna have to say no, no to the order of no Coco. Quote, quote, quote. Uh, no. Okay, he's on, he's, he's got electric now. Buddy, I, I hate to tell you this, but th they're the bodies, you know. So take a nap. Shush, shush, shush. And give me your money. Oh, no way! Not even my best moves can raise you! Well fought! If you can accept the feat like a true knight, you'll always have your dignity. No, they'll never let me into the order! Ah, never ever! Ah! No one will know. No one will ever know. Let's go back to the village. And if you're wondering why I'm so far away, power outage, once again. Yeah, who would have thought? 
Whoa, you have seven music sheets? Ah, oh, magnificent. I'll take 500 gold for each. There's the money I needed. Ah, the waltz of the Trapel King. Uh, upon my first recital, the Trapel King started flapping spins and said, Oh, I'm so happy I could spit. And what happened next, I refer, I prefer not to talk about it. Tragic. Now then, I will deliver... I don't have a meal ticket. Uh, I'll buy a meal ticket, and then I'll deliver it! The, the, the wrong button. There we go. Please give me meal. I wish for health. Thank you. Ah, what more of a... No. Give it to me anyway. And with that, we will make our way on out of here. I do not know how long this episode is, as I no longer have my timer where it should be. But, what's a long episode, eh? You know? What's a long episode with a bunch of edits that I have to do, eh? You know? Mole Knight, let's go. So... A little fun fact out of this area of three, Mole Knight is the first of three of the bleh, of the three knights that we will do that we would do in this area in a speed run. For a particular reason we will cover here very shortly. Um until then, I'm gonna go fishing. Oh. It's never what I want, you know. It's always bad news. Um, this is a very treacherous platform. We want to maximize the amount of gold we can get out of this, but we also don't want to do anything stupid. So, I'm just going to carefully tear through these platforms. Boop, 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 Good. Let's progress. Ow. So, Mole Knight, um, this particular level has been the bane of many a runner, as this stage has a skip in it for speedrunning. I'm going to cover speedrunning for this stage in particular because, you know, there's, there's a lot involved. There is a massive skip that is more performance-based than it is um, glitch-based, so that's worth mentioning, you know. And there is a thing that helps speedrunning in general. So, best of both worlds. Say hello to Big to Big Bodo. He's back, baby. He was a mighty card for our cause, and now he's a pain in our side. Uh, Big Bodo is an auto-scrolling section that we're probably quite familiar with from Spectre of Torment and King Knight as well. And, uh, <laughs> Plague of Shadows. Yeah, that's funny. No, we just freaking walked right through him in Plague of Shadows and just walked through lava. You know, god stuff. Um, but no, his real purpose is to keep you safe above the lava. And he moves very slowly underneath platforms, above lava, like I said. And really and truly, he is a danger to us all. That was a very easy fight against that guy if he had the flare wand. Wow. Okay, uh, next checkpoint, we get to see our new trench shovel. Just digs up all that in one hit. Got these little guys we can bounce on top of. Beetos, no, not a big deal as usual. And birders, always a big deal as usual. Hate them. Hi. This ability is so freaking useful. It will by far be my preference to the end of the game, so get, get used to this one. I'm not going to shovel through the other ones like I did with other campaigns. This is our new best friend. <laughs> I will buy the others, mind you, but I will not be using them for nearly as long. I have a bias. <laughs> okay, maybe I'll use them, just, just not for long. Like, if I have, like, multiple, like, mini th miniature things to do on the map, then, uh, yeah, they, they, this, this will most certainly get... They will most certainly get shafted to just dying in lava. Here we 
know, there's one of those outfits that lowers the amount of gold you lose in lava, but you know, we're not using that because I'm I'm a fool, right? Yeah, that's what it is. That's the, that's the problem with it. Shoot. Okay. Really just need to go for those fish, huh? I really bit myself in the freaking buoy there, didn't I? Anyway. I don't want to talk about it. Okay. Let's do that again. One more time. Nope. Nope. Let's not get, let's not get too hasty. We know what we're after, and we're gonna get it. Oh boy. Boy, boy, oh boy, oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Oh, I sure do love this. Oh, yes, indeed, I do. Oh, this is just my favorite right here. Mm. <laughs> Die to the same spot five times, please. It's a cool party trick. Okay. I'm resetting the level. I'll be back in a minute. Okay. So we got our stuff back. Well. We got... The stuff we had before, we lost our stuff back. Going back in here. <laughs> uh, that's a safe idea. I'm scared, y'all. We got our music sheet. That's nice. I'm sure the bard will be happy with that. Oh my god, we made it. <laughs> Kill him. Anyway, that was that was painful. Uh, let's never speak of that again. Thanks. Uh, these platforms will start exploding as soon as you hit them, and go along a trail-like pattern. You're probably quite familiar with those at this rate, so I'm not gonna waste much time on that. You know what I've already spoken, so away we go. And now, slime. Sure, you're quite familiar with that too. But most importantly, Chester! That's why I had to reset. <laughs> ah, boy. The Dust Knuckles! Check this out! Yeah, we can just kind of fly now. That's, that's a, that's, that's a pretty useful trick. I ain't gonna lie to you. So, in speedrunning, the Dust Knuckles are used very frequently for just pretty much everything <laughs> as far as it, as far as um, boss fights go these things are really good for getting some quick damage in you can just go back and forth and have iframes galore with them they don't use too much magic but they do use a decent amount so they have to be used slightly in moderation so they're not exactly the end-all be-all but they are most certainly one of the most useful Abilities you get in the game and one of the first in a speed run So always good to know as you probably recall by the way the slime will turn the lava slimes into regular slimes once again nothing new there And we can also turn the lava into slime as well Not just the lava slimes the lava itself can just be fully Transformed into solid matter that makes sense Neat little trick we got here Unless I mess it up. Bam. Attempt number two. Slide that on by. And we're going to want to be careful here or else we'll die instantly. Very, very tight jumps here. If you're not safe, you will very quickly die. Hate to break it to you. Uh, and this one here, you want to slap a slime onto the lava. Get that little extra air time to get those gems. Very nice. And this is a very dangerous one. 
Don't want to miss that. Alrighty. Getting some slight PTSD from the last bonus room. But that one wasn't nearly as bad. Thank God. Got another section of these trail blocks. Oh my god! I didn't cancel my attack. I didn't cancel my stab, rather. No, I'm not going back. No, I'm not cutting the tape. What am I, crazy? What do you think I am, crazy? Eh. Think I'm gonna freaking make myself edit more stuff just because it's convenient for my dear viewers who I care a lot about huh you think I care about y'all think I care about y'all huh is that everything this is think I care about the convenience of the watcher I do that's why I do it 90% of the time but that time I'm bitter so I didn't do it yeah how do you feel about that outsmarted y'all Hey, okay. I don't know why I did that. There were no gems involved in that. Anyway. Perish. I can't get that over there now. Whoops. Uh. Wait. Can I, like... <laughs> I thought I could use that! Ah! Okay. Yeah, I'll be nice. Be right back, y'all. Oh, why? Oh, why have I done? Yeah, I'm doing this now. I'll see y'all in a minute. Okay, that's 10 minutes of my life I'm never getting back. Yes, that was 10 minutes. Good. Great, and that was right before a checkpoint, and um, ooh, ooh, boy, I'm having a day. I'm having a dandy day, let me tell you. That could have gone a lot better. Big Bodo, take us away. I'm not breaking that checkpoint. I've learned my lesson. I do not want to meddle with forces I do not understand. Such as birders. Now we got him. We got him, bro. A bunch of angry birders. Those are some angry birds. Hey, Big Bodo, don't don't kill me, please. Thank you. Okay, yeah, that was a close call. Anyway, we've made it to the end. Let's go. Uh, let's go. Actually, beat the crap out of Mole Knight for what he's done. I could have used the dust knuckle there, but oh well. You're out of your depth, Spelunker. Are you lost? The ruins below belong to the ages, Mole Knight. They're mine now, but more importantly, is that your digging implement? <laughs> I am astonished you made it ten feet down with that rusty trinket. I will bury you. It's not the size of the trinket, it's how you use it. Remember that, party people. Also, don't be weird. Like me. And make freaking nar jokes with Mole Knight. Goodbye. But wait, we must first sleep. For what are we if we are not a sleeping knight?
I don't know, literally anything else. Anyway, that was disgraceful. I'm sad. Um, let's, uh, let's never speak of this again. And, uh, how about next time we go to the Iron Whale? Yeah, that sounds like fun. Iron Whale, baby! Iron Whale! Next time! Love it, poggers. Au revoir! Bye-bye! Go, 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 go see your family. Please go outside, touch grass. Blah.